the last day of changing spouts. Got three guys here helping. So what we're gonna do is cut off this year old spout. You can watch me do it. And I don't throw any of this stuff on the ground, but it's hard to videotape and put on our little gadget. It's also hard to do this when your fingers are freezing. So that's the new spout right there. We'll line them up. On it goes. 9,000 of them to do, or 10 actually. So right now we're running three guys on one line. Got one cutter who's gotten the old spouts off, two guys putting them on, and uh, probably putting in 275 an hour, which is huge. I've never tried this before, so I'm pretty excited. This is working great. The guy with me, my buddy Tyler, you'll see him a lot as you subscribe to our channel uh, so what we're doing today old spout cut off old spout insert old spout in pocket i don't like to leave a mess in the woods this fancy new little spout they came out with you can see how thin the walls are so the idea here is that as we drill to the tree drill the hole in the tree it will conform to the hole if our hole isn't exactly perfectly round. So we'll stick this here in the little gadget and uh, on she goes. So it's probably 18 degrees out today. It's cold. But uh, don't want it. But you just gotta work harder on days like this. So this is pretty neat. This tree here literally rotted from the inside out the old beech tree look at him still standing it's been like this for six seven years but all the way around it he's still standing on this big old nasty side hill uh where i'm standing right now there's probably a hundred foot in drop in elevation and another hundred foot that way this is one of our ugly little side hills that I get to deal with. this here international truck I gotta take this flatbed off and sell it this is my old uh, old international she pretty rough shape kind of tired out so I gotta take the flatbed dump off of this one mounted on this truck Ooh, look at them magnums and this truck I gotta take all the sides off it turn it into a flatbed take tailgate off of it and this truck a whole sap with the red truck I haul hay with. Slow. Hold it. My shop's finally clean. This is gonna be the new hay truck. We gotta put a body on it. Off the other hay truck. Put a PTO and a hydraulic pump. We're going to take my Ford apart, uh, L9000. It's a 1979 and it only has 90,000 miles on it. Um, I built the box so I can haul silage, grain, and then it comes off and we can haul hay with it. And uh, what we're gonna do today is we're gonna take the sides off it and it will become the sap truck for hauling the sap to the sugar house.
vacuum pumps are finished, but they all need an hour of run time before I take them to the woods. Make sure the alternators are charging, the pumps are pumping, the hydraulic pumps are pumping oil through the coolers. So that'll be probably Sunday's project. We'll move them to the woods on Monday and we're ready to go.